The phase velocity of a wave is the rate at which the phase of the wave propagates in space. This is the velocity at which the phase of any one frequency component of the wave travels. For such a component, any given phase of the wave will appear to travel at the phase velocity. The phase velocity is given in terms of the wavelength lambda and period t is or, equivalently, in terms of the wave's angular frequency omega, which specifies angular change per unit of time, and wave number k, which represents the proportionality between the angular frequency omega and the linear speed nu p. To understand where this equation comes from, imagine a basic sine wave, a cos. Given time t, the source produces omega t, 2 pi equals ft oscillations. At the same time, the initial wave front propagates away from the source through the space to the distance x to fit the same amount of oscillations, kx equals omega t, so that the propagation velocity v is v equals x, t equals omega, k. The wave propagates faster when higher frequency oscillations are distributed less densely in space. Formally, phi equals kx minus omega t is the phase. Since omega equals minus d phi dt and k equals plus d phi dx, the wave velocity is v equals dx, dt equals omega k. Relation to group velocity, refractive index and transmission speed. Since a pure sine wave cannot convey any information, some change in amplitude or frequency, known as modulation, is required. By combining two signs with slightly different frequencies and wavelengths, the amplitude becomes a sinusoid with phase speed delta omega, delta k. It is this modulation that represents the signal content. Since each amplitude envelope contains a group of internal waves, this speed is usually called the group velocity, Vg. In a given medium, the frequency is some function omega of the wave number, so in general, the phase velocity Vp equals omega, k and the group velocity Vg equals d omega, dk depend on the frequency and on the medium. The ratio between the phase speed Vp and the speed of light C is known as the refractive index, n equals C, Vp equals Ck, omega. Taking the derivative of omega equals Ck, n with respect to k, we recover the group speed, noting that C, n equals Vp. This shows that the group speed is equal to the phase speed only when the refractive index is a constant dn, dk equals zero, and in this case the phase speed and group speed are independent of frequency. Omega, k equals d omega, dk equals c, n. Otherwise, both the phase velocity and the group velocity vary with frequency. And the medium is called dispersive. The relation omega equals omega is known as the dispersion relation of the medium. The phase velocity of electromagnetic radiation may, under certain circumstances, exceed the speed of light in a vacuum, but this does not indicate any superluminal information or energy transfer. It was theoretically described by physicists such as Arnold Sommerfeld and Elia Kuto and Brillouin. See dispersion for a full discussion of wave velocities.